another update on X-Men 97 that this time reveals that Rogue's flight and action sequence was directly inspired by Man of Steel. Who's excited to talk a little bit more about Zack Snyder? Yeah, me either, but hey, here we are, so let's do it. So yeah, believe it or not, X-Men 97 was intentionally, unintentionally, or as the man responsible for the first season says, subconsciously, he believes that when writing X-Men 97 and coming up with Rogue Punching Bastion, that this was more or less inspired, again, subconsciously or not by Superman when he's punching Zod and they're flying through the cornfield and everything like that. So, um, you know, this has gotten a lot of a uh, discussion going, traction, people on both sides fighting. You know, you know how it is. You guys know how it is. Um, cool. What's bad about this? The man clearly really likes Zack Snyder's stuff. So when he's working on it, he's pulling from it, whether it's intentional or not. You know, this happens all the time. You look at writers. They pull from writers and styles and things that they've seen. Other directors do this exact thing. Producers. I mean, it's exactly how it works, right? Artists, for example. They will get inspired by another artist and then do their own take on whatever that artist did. You know, art is imitated by other art. It's just how it works. Um, I don't find anything wrong with this. I've seen some people upset. I've seen some people hating. I've seen some people say this shouldn't have happened. He should just come up with original things. Yeah, It just seems pointless to me. Like, who cares? You know? Man of Steel had great action. So if you want to copy a scene from that or a style, that's awesome. You know, we've seen other things do the exact same motion and punching where Superman was flying fast and he like punches Zod and then the camera pulls up to them and he does it again. We've seen that copied countless times. Did Zack Snyder invent that? Well, some people will tell you yes. You can do your own research, maybe find out that he was inspired by something else as well. Whatever the case is, who cares? He used something for inspiration. It happened. It's cool. It looked great on animation. That's all that matters. Oh.